Kai Jenner, makeup mogul and star of, has opened up about the ongoing criticism she has faced over her evolving appearance. Throughout her years in the spotlight, Jenner has been criticized for her plump lips, leading to accusations of lying about receiving fillers. However, in an interview with, Jenna expressed her frustration with the constant scrutiny. It's just years and years of not feeling like my face or looks are accepted, she said. There's nothing anyone could ever say now that would hurt me. Despite the criticism, Jenna has remained confident in her choices. I always love myself and I still love myself, she said. One of the biggest misconceptions about me is that I was like an insecure child and I had so many surgeries to change my entire face, which is false. Kylie Jenner has not seen your comments about her style evolution at least. That's what she's saying on the record. The reality star was profiled in on Thursday in a story pegged to her new business ventures, which include Anna Perfume. Jenner was down to talk about the way her style has changed, but shut down speculation that it has anything to do with boyfriend Timothy Chalamet. I don't have this thick mane down to my butt. I don't have lash extensions. I don't have these long claws, Jenna said, noting that she is stripping down a little bit. She later added, it takes me a while after I have a baby to feel like myself again, referring to the birth of her son, IRA, in 2022. Then you get your body back and you're like, wait, the trends have changed. Specifically, the trends we're talking about today are the cottage core Glen Puffy sleeve vibes she brought, documented via Instagram. At the time, there was speculation that Chalamet was the impetus behind Jenna's era. When asked if she had seen those comments, Jenna said she hadn't. I don't know how I feel about that, the makeup mogul said. I just don't want to talk about personal things. Jenna also told writer Jessica Tester that she only reads comments that are related to her businesses. Well damn. One day you're for everyone to see, the next you don't want to tell the paper of record whether or not that same guy likes it when you wear a maxi dress. Ripe to those few months where we were getting about the couple. Now we don't even know if Jenna has seen. Any longtime fan of Kylie Jenna can tell you the mogul has undergone a quiet style metamorphosis over the past year. Gone are the days of King Killy into Fashion Week Kylie, who makes regular viral front row appearances at Jacquemus, Jean Paul Gaultier, or Schiaparelli runway shows clad in a Forbes line headgown, no less. In a new interview with the, Jenna confirmed what the fans already knew that her personal style started to shift about one year ago. Around that time, a son turned one year old. It takes me a while after I have a baby to feel like myself again, she explains the publication. Then you get your body back and you're like, wait, the trends have changed. Some began to speculate that Jenna's sartorial transformation was due to her romance with Timothy Chalamet, who she also began dating about a year ago. When asked about the theory, she had a coy response. I don't know how I feel about that. She succinctly added, I just don't want to talk about personal things. Both Jenna and Chalamet have kept a tight lid on their relationship since dating rumors first emerged in April 2023. Though Chalamet seemed to hint at his love life while commenting on the intense public scrutiny on his personal life in an interview with last October. You've got to have the experiences in your personal life that are usable to you, he said at the time. The experiential rush of my career taking off was so new to me that those were the experiences that were feeding my work for a while. But you've got to have real experiences. Human experiences. You've got to fall in love. You've got to be bored. Kai Jenner is the youngest of her sisters, but that hasn't stopped her from amassing a net worth most can only dream of. Not only does the mother of two occasionally appear on the family's reality show where she's been a part of since childhood, but she also has several brands, including Kelly Cosmetics, Skin, and Baby who've launched countless products over the years to help amass her fortune. As Daily Mail reports, Jenna's attorneys trademarked her name for dozens of items in June 2019. Among them were spirits, liquor, wine, alcoholic cocktail mixes, prepared alcoholic cocktail, and prepared wine cocktails. Interestingly, it wasn't until February 2023 when an application for Sprinter, her new hard seltzer line came in. As the outlet notes, this is being perceived as a direct shot at her baby daddy, Travis Scott, who's planning to relaunch his cacti drinks later this month. La Flame filed a trademark for his hard beverage in June 2020 and launched it in March 2021, amid his relationship with Jenna. Following backlash from that year's, production ceased, leaving fans thirsty for more. Cacti 2.0 is arriving on shelves on March 15. Not long before his ex's Sprinter drinks will go on sale, Kylie ripped his idea plain and simple, a source, allegedly close to Scott, told the outlet. It wasn't until they split that she got serious about this, and she did out of spite, it further pointed out. 
At the time when Kylie's team got this trademarked, they got everything trademarked. She requested a trademark for dozens of products, leaving it open to creating any kind of business she wanted in the future.